Happy Sunday, Gypsy Dwellers. We're still working on the floors. As you can see, we got this big mess. We uh, still have leaks coming in. We've had rain a um, few times. Here you go. Now let's get this out first, and we'll just have that ready. I just need to. I don't know how to keep this door open for you. Oh, it doesn't stay open. I don't know. The wind might knock it down. So, back here behind the driver's seat, it's all rotted. Far in here. Underneath here, underneath here, yeah, this cabinet, here. it's all rotted, and Dave tore out the wood. Unfortunately, right here, oops, right there, is our furnace. So, it, right, right now, the furnace has no support, so we have to figure that out. This door... This piece here broke, so we have to get that replaced. Um, the guy had put wood over rotting wood. We probably, we, uh, but we even had to pull out metal that was on the floor. This here is a piece of wood that was behind the driver's seat. As you can see, it is completely soaked. So that's how we're spending our Sunday. It's chiseling out flooring, so yeah, if, just so, just as a warning, and it's not to scare anybody off. You look like you're getting a decent deal, and then when you get into it and you make your changes, you find out things aren't the way the person told you. Uh, we set, we assume the guy thought he had it fixed, um, as he told me. I just had to fix up the flooring a little bit. And it would be as good as new. But he glued down all this wood that he screwed down with liquid nails. And he silicone. Oh, yeah, he siliconed everything. Yeah, so. Actually, I think this piece of wood does have to come up. That's too much hassle because you'd have to unbolt this. You're just going to let it dry out as much as you can. It'll dry out at the leaks fixed here. Alright, so I'm gonna pause this video yeah, and get, get back to work. Old wood out here. Yeah, because yeah, it's even wet behind here. We need to pull all this out and then spray it down with uh, bleach. Seriously, I don't know what he has behind here, but. Pull that piece off. I'll wait it's screwed into the wall, ain't it? I don't see it screwed in anywhere. Yeah, it is. Right here. Because that's what's holding this piece of wood on the outside. No, there's you, holes, but I don't see anything in yeah, there. Yeah, there's screws coming. He from cut this. it off. No, I know. There's screws coming from this side into this wood. Okay. That's what's holding all this. So until you tear this wall out, I, you have to leave that. I just happened that piece. I don't think he had screwed in. Oh, he Watch it. Yeah, the glue, but there's black mold in there. There might be some behind here too, but there ain't nothing you can do. At least you got that. No, all you can do is throw paneling over this. Yeah, there's paneling right here. He went over. So yeah, you just need new paneling. You're gonna cut this out and then just put new paneling. At least it can dry out now. Yeah, you need to get all the white shit out of here. Right here. Yeah, he thought he had it fixed, but yeah, this is just paneling. I'm not sure how these things are held together. This is all coming out anyway, just paneling. Right here. Are you mad at that guy? I'm frustrated. <laughs> Because now this thing is nickel and diming us. I mean, I thought it was just... No, I knew this paneling was going to have to get replaced. Well, I knew something was going on, but I figured it was good enough to just do a couple little things. And, and then paneling over there. I'm not messing with tearing that all apart. I'm just going to put a piece of white paneling on where he has all his wood. But this wall is coming out. You just want to get rid of the mold. You maybe. know, you could just seal up the seams and then I could just paint white over it. Yeah, you can do that. You're going to have to put something over right it. Right now, I just want to make this Let's cheap get the. As no, we're trying to get rid of the mold. So don't you don't know. understand. No, this is original um, paneling. paneling from the factory. So. 
What do we got over here, honey? And there's I'm actually a piece gonna... of metal right here. Right here's a piece of metal. No, I know. That's from the factory. Yeah. I think. I don't know. Yeah. We got to get all this wood out because I got to put a piece of plywood down here. Okay. I'm not done with the plywood. No, I'm still trying to get the wood underneath. I got it. Where's the hammer? Where's my hammer? I think it's going to look something like that. That's an odd shaped piece. Yep. I'm coming. It really isn't doing that. You got it? Yep. Oh, okay. Huh. Here's a bag, man. It's a moldy musky. Huh. Yeah, see, they had the carpet nailed to the... Uh... Wood? What a mess. This I'm is, just trying to figure out. I know. Is. This is the mess I was not expecting. I was expecting us to just finish up the floors, clean stuff up, you know, maybe fix a couple little things, and it was good. I didn't see any leaks. Mm -hmm. with, the, with the snow, I didn't see any leaks. I think the guy thought he had them all fixed. I heard the agent yeah. and shit fixed. I feel like I've been duped. I'm frustrated that I allowed myself to be taken advantage of, except for I'm trying not to let it get to me because that could have happened to anybody. Well, yeah, he would have screwed the next person. The way, the way he hit it, anybody could have missed it. Oh, yeah. So I have to keep that in mind that... I'm not stupid, but I just feel I just feel foolish. That's why he used three quarter inch plywood, so you wouldn't notice. And every time I'd like really look into something, I could sense that he was getting really nervous. Oh, nervous Nelly. Mm -hmm. You know, just like when I wanted to take the front cover off to see what was behind there, thinking I'd see the engine. Oh, well, we ain't going to take it off unless you're really serious about buying it. Like, well, I can't tell you. I'm like, okay, well, I'm serious about wanting to buy it. So we took it off. So I could see him. Oh, you're talking to Hood, yeah. Yeah? Yeah, I didn't make a difference. He just didn't want to remove it. He, I know he didn't want to remove it. He's lazy. He's like, oh, it's really hard to get back on. I got it off and on by myself, no problem. So I don't know. You know, it's just... Uh, the only thing is I want to let it dry out. Right. I say cut this off. Yeah, cut off that carpet. 